Hello, I'm Sasha. We are still at the GotToBeMobile.com tablet meetup at the center stage. And over here we have the new Apple netbook. No, of course it's not. But uh, Hector, tell us a little bit about that device and show, show the viewers maybe uh, uh, what is going on with that little netbook over here. Well, with this one is the, is the new Mac Nano. I'm just kidding. No, <laughs> no this, I got actually Mac OS uh, running on this MSI Win. I upgraded it to 2 gigabytes RAM. It's got the 120 gigabyte hard drive. Uh, as you can see, it comes out of sleep in, almost instantly. Right. And uh, I have all the applications, sound is working, everything's How working. How about Wi-Fi? Wi-Fi is also working. Great. With, with the actual original, you don't have to uh, change out the Wi-Fi part anymore. That was a problem. Yes, yeah. it was. A, yeah, apparently they just actually released, see this is the program that, uh, that you run to actually detect the right. uh, Wi-Fi as you can see is connected. Okay, uh, that's cool. Yeah, and this tells you everything here. It's got the webcam here. And even the webcam is working? Yes, the webcam is working that's also, cool. yeah. I, I just loaded up everything, so I don't know if I got everything uh, <laughs> <laughs> set up correctly, because I just uh, redid this last night. Uh, yeah, I, I oh, that's that. okay, I, I guess we're getting it. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, see, it's just that. Uh, so, um, um, do you think that um, a macOS installation on a netbook with a 10.2 inch could be really um, a device that you would use for your everyday use? Uh, for, for like a quick internet or like if you're surfing the net, I would think so. That's actually a pretty good size. Or like if you're doing a quick uh, email or but if you're maybe constantly all day long, it might not be a good idea because it, it might get a little bit small on the screen. But, but yeah. actually, they're pretty nice and portable right, to take around everywhere. This was like really light. I, I got the three cell battery here. Right. This one. It, it gives me like a little bit like a little over two hours on this one. Okay, how about the performance of macOS on this Intel Atom platform? Actually, it runs really well. Okay. I've actually um, I've loaded up other uh, like iTunes and uh, I got the iCalendar, Safari. Right. And I didn't have time to put it, but I, have, I, I do have installed the the Microsoft Office 2000 suite and it runs very nice. It's, it doesn't uh, any lag performance or anything at all. Uh, it's it's really nice. It's all the volume control. Uh, they even have the on-screen. Oh, that's yeah, cool. See, you can see it, everything here. That's the meal, and as you can see, the volume goes down. Right. Everything in. Uh, that's the, nice. Yeah, the brightness also how it works just Great. right off, and. Uh, it's really nice. Uh, it's running everything in there, and I also have Windows Seven on this one. Very cool, very cool. Yeah. So you have a multi-boot device yeah. over here, yeah. definitely. <laughs> so that looks that looks pretty promising to see um, macOS on on such a you know low performance netbook. Yes. And um, well, that was Dasha, and that was Hector. Thank you so much for the introduction of your devices. And that was the Gotta Be Mobile gathering or tablet meetup at the center stage at CS 2009.